Good morning. Thank, for, thank you for starting your day with Denver 7 News. I'm Molly Hendrickson. And I'm Brian Sanders. Let's get right to our top stories. And there is still no projected winner in the race for the White House. A handful of key battleground states are still up for grabs. Right now, Joe Biden has 253 electoral votes. Trump has 214. 270 is the number to win the White House. And you may see reports of 264 electoral votes for Biden. That's because some news outlets are calling Arizona for Biden. ABC News has not called that state yet. Colorado's top health official warns COVID-19 is circulating in the state now more than ever, and we need to get this under control. One in 100 people in Denver is estimated to be contagious. There is no sign of slowing or any plateau. The state epidemiologist warns that we've seen an increase in cases of people over the age of 40, which is also translated into more hospitalizations among that age group. It's weeks later than normal, but ski season is finally starting in our nearby mountains. Keystone is opening a top to bottom path today thanks to a new snowmaking system. To ski at Keystone this week, you do need a season pass or an epic day pass, a reservation and a mask. People camped out overnight to be the first up the lift. 